Hello so there guys, today a small tutorial on how to make a fresh install of macOS Sierra GM, so the final release version, not yet uh, available or released to, to the community, but for the developers and also for the public beta testers, it's uh, available for download. What you have to do, if you are a developer or a public beta tester, uh, or even if you are not, you can go to the site, okay, to the Apple beta software program, sign in, okay, and then uh, sign in with your with your or create an account, um, create an account for that. But if you are already a public beta tester, uh, you can go ahead, and there are here as you can see get uh, and we'll make a zoom get the mac os sierra golden master candidate okay i already have done that but for this tutorial i'm uh, doing it again okay you may you get the mac os the sierra candidate um, don't forget to back up your mac there is a code here okay and of course when you click this it will take you to the app store okay and you can redeem your code and as you can see here yeah, there is also mac os sierra, sierra public beta that I, I was using but now i'm using the golden master one it was installed on the 8th of september of this year okay so it will it is uh, 13 minutes to complete the download we are of course I'm not waiting for that I'll make a pause in the video and afterwards I'll return and I will tell you what you will need to make that fresh install okay be right away very well after the download is done this window will pop up okay this window here will pop up immediately okay no need, no need to do nothing after the download is done the window will pop up if you press continue you'll be making an update to your existing uh, mac os okay so it's only an update and not a clean install so what you have to do is just quit and uh, that uh, installer will be on your application folder I have it my application folder here on the dock uh, but if you don't don't have it just go ahead to your finder go to applications scroll down and it's in, in Mac OS Sierra installer this is in Portuguese you'll have it in English okay so here you have it and uh, now the next step to make the the bootable pen drive uh, i suggest a pen drive but you can use an sd card or even partition an external hard drive to make this uh, installer okay but i will use a pen drive and at least keep in mind you have to have uh, eight gigs now first step uh, i will leave the link in the description there is a program or an app called install disk creator i will leave the link again in the description it's a free app okay there is also an option to make terminal commands but if you have if we have a uh, free app to do this why not and take advantage of that and not put all that terminal commands so go ahead uh, download uh, this this in this install this creator and this will pop up immediately since you have already your installer for mac os in your applications it will appear but if it doesn't you will go come here and select the os installer it, go ahead scroll down and see if if you can find it mm -hmm. here it is okay you click it and open and it will be right here then you'll have to uh, 
I, I, I suggest you, you put your pen drive already in your Mac. Don't forget that pen, pen drive will be completely erased. Uh, you select it. I already have done it. Okay, so I, I already am running the Golden Master, um, Golden Master on this uh, MacBook, and uh, you select. Okay, don't forget everything you have in this pen. Pen will disappear, and then what you have to do is just create the, in the installer. I'm not going to do that because I have already done it and it takes it takes at least, I don't know, 10 to 15 minutes to create this installer, okay? So, this is the step that you have to do. After that, you will be prompt here that you need to reboot your computer and press the option key. Uh, the pen drive is still on your Mac, okay? Now, word of advice. Since you are doing a fresh install, all uh, your documents, your photos, your music, your important data will be erased. The disk, your hard drive, will be completely erased. So, keep in mind that you have to make a backup of all your important data. I will not be responsible for your losses, okay, regarding that. If you know Time Machine, uh, you can use Time Machine, okay, uh, on an external hard drive. If you don't want and just want to keep your important data, select it and copy from your, okay, let's, let's imagine, I will give you an example. Uh, you want to copy your music, just click uh, Control C to copy, okay, and then uh, put it on on, a, on your backup drive, okay, external drive. Don't forget that the disk will be completely erased, and if you don't do this, you will lose everything, okay. But uh, I suppose everyone should have a backup of everything, okay. Don't trust only on your computer hard drive, okay. Again, don't forget to back up all your important data because you lose everything. Now, uh, I will. This is the steps that you have to take. Uh, I will not do it because I already done it. But I will. I will tell you how uh, it's done, and I will now stop this screencast and I'll go to my external camera to tell you uh, how to do it, okay? Be right back. Very well, so final step. You go and restart your computer. Wait for the Boeing, okay, and click the Option key. Option or Alt, depending on the country. And here it is. You have several options here. You have your main drive, okay, main drive. You have your, I'm sorry, there is lots and lots of, here you have, you have your main drive. Uh, bootcamp also I didn't refer that the bootcamp partition that you have already it, it will also be raised I have my time machine and uh, I have here my time machine and I have the disk that I have created this yellow one okay here okay this is what you have to click let's go ahead and click it and it will restart on the bootable drive that we have that we have created <coughs> it will take some time but i will just show you the next steps and i will not of course do the full install because i don't i already have it but the next steps there are one or two things that you have to do in 
in order to install your new, new Mac OS. Okay, this is the screen over here that will appear, okay? It's the utility for our Mac util utilities. And there is this utility. I will try and zoom a little bit for you to see. This utility over here, okay? And because if you click install, no, we need to go to disk utility, continue. And here you have it, okay? So what you have to do is go to your Apple main drive your, from your computer and erase, okay? And it will ask you for a name, okay, and everything. Mac OS extended, so journaled, and um, G, uh, G U I D uh, partition map, okay, and then erase. Of course, I will not do that. After you have done it, you go ahead and skip, go from the disk utility and install mac os click continue and it will be done so guys this is it okay um i hope you like this uh, tutorial if you have any questions please leave on the comments and uh, if you like this kind of videos go ahead and give a like i have plenty more to show thank you very much and please click also on the subscribe button for you new guys that are don't don't know this channel okay thank you see you on the next one bye bye